Hey, what's going on, everybody? In this video, we are going to be talking about Mighty Morphin Power Rangers Season 2, Episode 31. When is a ranger not a ranger? Let's break it down. Hit that intro, rangers. You are watching the fan club. You're watching the fan club. And you're watching the fan club. Do you know what time it is? And you know what time it is. It's time for the fan club. Let's go. Hey! I can't do this on my own, because you know they Hey, what's going on, everyone? Welcome to the fan club. It is your boy, Bros Dan Brosnan, in the building. We are so happy to have you guys. And in this video, we are going to be breaking down Mighty Morphin Power Rangers Season 2, Episode 31. When is a ranger not a ranger? One of my favorite episodes during that second half of the second season. It is kind of weird because you have three new rangers coming on in there and it changes like the whole storyline and the way it was supposed to be with Trini, Zach, Jason, etc. But it still is a lot of fun. I cannot lie. So let's get into it. In When is a Ranger Not a Ranger, the Power Rangers find themselves facing a peculiar challenge, memory loss. Lord Zed, inspired by Adam's school project on kaleidoscopes, transforms the device into the monstrous scatterbrain. This creature unleashes an energy beam that not only demorphs the rangers, but also wipes their memories clean. While Bulk and Skull in their misguided attempts to uncover the rangers' identities stumble upon the battle and witness the transformation, the rangers are left with no recollection of their heroic past. The episode unfolds with a mix of humor and suspense as the Power Rangers try to navigate their amnesia, encountering their friends who they no longer recognize. Despite their confusion, the new rangers Rocky Adam and Aisha work with Zordon to develop a plan to reverse the effect. Their strategy involves using prisms to deflect Scatterbrain's beam, but as they prepare to execute this plan, Adam too becomes a victim of Scatterbrain's mind-wiping abilities. With the situation spiraling out of control, Bulk and Skull, who just figured out the true identities of the Power Rangers, find themselves inadvertently holding the key to their salvation. They pick up the prisms which bounce off Scatterbrain's beam back onto the Rangers, restoring their memories and allowing them to morph once again. While Bulk and Skull emerge from the encounter with no recollection of the events, they are left with the satisfaction of having played a crucial role in saving the Power Rangers. Zed's frustration at the unexpected turn of events leads him to grow scatterbrain, but the Rangers, empowered by their recovered memories, swiftly defeat the monster with the Thunder Megazord. The episode ends on a lighthearted note with Bulk and Skull boasting about their supposed heroism, a testament to their obliviousness to their true role in the story. This was a great one, man. Bulk and Skull all season have been trying to figure out the identities of the Power Rangers, and they finally figured it out, man. It was awesome. And when they find out they're like them, Man, they've been under our nose the whole time and they kept throwing a wrench every single time Bulk and Skull would try to figure it out. It was great. Let's get into some of the notes from Ranger Wiki. Bulk and Skull's reaction to temporary discovering the Power Rangers' secret identities is identical to their reaction when the Space Power Rangers revealed their identities to Angel Grove in Space's Countdown to Destruction. This episode also references Day of the Dumpster, when the memory-wiped rangers first return to the command center. Billy notices Alpha and says, Whoa, a fully sentient, multifunctional automaton, representing his words from their first encounter. The scene even includes a similar view of Billy from Alpha's optic processor. Later in the show, Kimberly uses the same remark of can somebody come back to Earth and pick me up as she did in the first episode when the situation is explained to her. In an earlier script draft, the showdown of Bulk and Skull protecting the Rangers from Scatterbrain was originally going to take place in Angel Grove Park instead of the desert, and the Rangers would have originally stayed unmorphed after regaining their memories. This is pretty cool, man. I do gotta say, I love this episode. And 
Bulk and Skull are slowly becoming heroic in their own way. Like, yes, they're always going to show up and bring comedy, but they're not bullies anymore. They're going to start to become better people. And I, I do kind of like that because as humans, we do want to see you evolve. You know, when you're teenagers, you're a little bit more rowdy or a little bit more crazier. But as you get older, you start to grow up and see what really matters. And I think that's what's going to happen with Bulk and Skull and those characters. And there's some development there. And Jason Arvey and Paul Schreier just knock these characters out of the park. So what are your guys' thoughts? Let me know in the comments. Shout out all the fans out there that take the time out of their day to watch this content. You are the real MVPs and the reason why we can continue to make videos like this. Thanks again for watching and we'll see you next time. Peace. I want to take a second to shout out all of the Gold Ranger members, the Arctic Operator, Roderick Ham, Papillon Purple, Salima Ramirez, Steven Heffelman, Chaos Draco, Thomas Franco, Anime King Nick, Lewis Cairns, Sean Schiffer, and Torrent Dark Gray. Thank you guys so much for your support. And if you want a video shout out like this one, sign up to be a Gold Ranger member today. Hey, what's going on? Thank you so much for watching this video. Please like, subscribe, hit that share button. And if you can, please sign up to be a member today. We have three membership power-ups. We have the Gold Ranger power-up, the most popular. You get into our exclusive fan club chat group. We have fan exclusive videos that we are adding monthly now. And you get a video shout out. Yes, folks, at the end of our videos, I will shout out your name. Name. We also have the Quantum Ranger Power Up where you get monthly meetings online with me. Yes, folks, we will talk once a month on Zoom and you can give me your ideas for future episodes. And then we have a professional package, the Dr. K Power Up. That is for businesses that want to tap into the platform. If you guys can, please sign up to be a member today. It is highly appreciated and it helps us keep these videos going. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time. Peace. Hi. Hi. We're Bulk and Skull. Skull. We, we have are been requested, requested by, by the, the Fun Club, Club to say something funny.